the Amer Kular off of Mount Temple. 2,000 feet of tight, not really tight actually, just properly widthed, steep Kular skiing in the Canadian Rockies of Alberta. Let's do it! Driving for two days now, 17 hours from Cook City directly up here to Lake Louise in Alberta, Canada. <laughs> Lots of driving. <laughs> the way you do it is you, you eat while you're driving. And my Google Maps brought me to Golden, expecting I could go over the one highway over to Lake Louise, so that added a added a couple hours because that was closed for, for rock removal I found out. Thanks Google Maps. But we're getting close, about 40 minutes away from Lake Louise and can't wait to toss on the skins and start going up there. That'll be awesome. Alright, cheers. So the Amer Kular. Cruise it over towards the line, towards Mount Temple. The Amer Kular is rather an aesthetic line. You can see it right here. And Mount Temple is undoubtedly a large mountain. Um, and the Amer Kular is just a spectacular feature. A perfect Kular, honestly, just very direct and around 1,800 feet of vertical. Uh, let's check the exact amount here on Fat Map. Top of the Kular is just at 9,900 feet. The base of the Kular lies at 8,000 feet. So nearly a 2,000 foot direct Kular. Mount Temple. Sorry for my cuckoo hair and my Nordic band. Wishes. Fresh snow. Nice. Fresh snow. Fresh snow! Sweet on top of the Amer Kular <laughs> and it's nuking. Wow, I boogied up that. How far in? 352 from the parking lot to the top. That's pretty fast. All right, Whew. let's go ski because it's cold. <laughs>
fuck yeah. I love the creeks. They're so nice. Hey, you couldn't see it underneath my pants, but I was wearing this stuff called Suma Tape. And it's a kinesiology tape with CBD and menthol. Cools the legs. And I use it really every day when I'm training. Uh, it just keeps me a little bit fresher. And these lines, part of the 50 Classic, are just you know, some of the lines that I ski as I'm usually going out every single day, whether that's running or skiing, in order to continue training and continue my endurance in mountain progression. And so mitigating any aches and pains and staying fresh is really important. I know that this is an ad, but I really do believe in this stuff. It works really well. <laughs>